the parallels between permaculture and um, ecology from a nature-based standpoint and play are all, all very intertwined. When you're looking at children from an ecological model, the traditional parks that you mentioned there and playgrounds, they're consumers when we're talking ecological terms. Mm -hmm. They're just consuming, consuming, consuming. It's like, hey, entertain me. What's next? I'm going to eat it up, spit it out. It's very limiting. But when you create a robust environment, they can become, become the providers or producers in those ecological terms. They're leaving little provocations or little cues for other children to investigate. It's their imprint and little tracks on the space that give that indication for another child to explore. They're providing to the environment. 